I ordered some wings. This is in sweet chili and pineapple sauce. Whenever I'm ordering wings, it has to be some sort of sweet sauce. And we also got a pizza, like just straight cheese pizza. Mmm, that's good. And the sauce is good, it's sweet. A little tiny. This is horrible lighting. Okay, I'm gonna try this pizza. Mm. Blue cheese, but the cheese is actually blue. So now it's how is it not blue? It's white. I don't know. I don't know why they call it blue cheese. I'm gonna find out why they call it blue cheese. Okay. So it's the following morning. Um, I'm now heading to the pool, but I just wanted to show you guys my outfit, my well, my swimsuit. I'm gonna show you guys a full view of it. It is so adorable. So let me walk over to this mirror. See, this is my kind of vacation. I like to go to very relaxing places that not much people are gonna visit. Um, that's just my vibe. So yeah, I'm just sharing a piece of this with you guys. I think it's just beautiful. It is the following morning. It's morning three, still on vacation. Uh, this morning, I am gonna be going to the mall. I am pretty excited about that. You know, when you're on vacation, that's kind of one of the things that you gotta do. You gotta hit up the malls, okay? So I'm just gonna use this um, Dove Beauty Bar Soap to wash my face this morning. Oh. My hope is that I get to pick up some stuff, clothing. While we're here, let me talk about some things that I do want to do on this channel. It is a new channel. For those of you guys who are new or if you don't know me from anywhere else, a lot of the people who are subscribed to this channel know me if, um, because I do review fragrances on another channel, my uh, Shauna J channel. So a lot of you guys know me from that channel and you know why I started this channel. I started this channel because a lot of you guys just wanted me to do content pertaining to, you know, uh, beauty and uh, body care and just miscellaneous things, you know, very feminine things. And I always kind of wanted to do videos like that because doing only fragrance uh, related videos, it kind of really does box you in. I created this channel for those of you guys and for myself. You know, I want to express myself. I want to show you guys who I really am. Because on my other channel, that person is also me. But like I said, you know, the content is so boxed in. You don't get a lot of um, opportunity to show your true, your true self. Um, so I'm grateful for this channel and I'm also grateful that you guys are enjoying this channel now I know a lot of you guys want to see me do like um, 
you guys want to see me do weight loss videos and stuff like that i'm gonna do that video of course i'm gonna walk you through exactly how i lost 70 pounds i think at this point it's like 73 pounds um that i lost so of course i'm gonna walk you guys through how i did that and how i did it in a way that I didn't feel like i was doing that because honestly um it was the best time i ever had losing weight i didn't feel like i was punishing myself i didn't feel depressed because a lot of times when i would like go on diet i would feel depressed like in the morning as soon as i would wake up and remember that i couldn't eat whatever i wanted to eat i would feel so down so out and if that's how you feel while being on a diet i could tell you you're doing something wrong you know what i'm saying you are you shouldn't feel like that um, you should feel happy and excited that you're losing the weight and that you found something that has worked for you. That's exactly how I felt while I was losing uh, my weight, while I was on the diet that I was on. So, of course, we're going to go into detail about how I did that. Of course, I'm also going to talk about how I kept it off for four years. It's been four years now since I lost all that weight. Um, I'm still losing weight. Um currently trying to gain to be honest i want to gain at least five pounds because i kind of went down a little bit um too small in my opinion um but i'm gonna tell you guys exactly how i do it and that video is gonna come really soon but i want it to be super organized super detailed i don't want you guys to have questions when i'm done i want you guys to feel as though you're gonna feel confident with all the information that i gave you so that's what's coming up on this channel i know it's what a lot of you guys want to see so it's definitely coming okay um of course we're gonna have so many different types of videos we're gonna have um body care haul talking about that i do have um a video coming up um, where I went to Dollar Store, Dollar Tree, I went to Dollar General, where I got a bunch of stuff. And I'm just going to show you guys some products that I picked up. So we're going to do a lot of different things, okay? We're going to do a lot of different things. Cooking, cleaning, shopping. You know, we're going to talk about life. We're going to talk about stresses, how to uh, be happy, how to embrace your life that you live how to live the life that you want to live. Don't live through other people. Live the life that you want to live. Because so for so many years, I would watch other people and think, oh, that must be amazing and whatnot. I'll be right back. So, I forgot to tell you guys that I kind of changed up my foundation. You guys know I use the Fenty Beauty foundation. And my original uh, color um it's 440 i went down two shades so i'm now at 420 um but i still believe that this is too light and this is too dark so i'm gonna try to mix both foundations mix both shades and just see if it's a little bit i don't know if it's a little bit more workable so yeah let's see you know black girl problems honestly like we gotta be mixing and trying to match. For me, the reason why it's hard to find my match is because I'm two different shades. Like around my face at the perimeter, I have like a red undertone, but in the middle, I'm more like light and it's more like yellow or golden. And for sure, like my chest area is like a golden undertone. It's very hard to match our undertone, boy. And you could see the difference like I, listen, we'd be here all day with me trying to, you know, explain to you why. So, yeah, I've been struggling to find my, uh, my shade. I'm kind of um, surprised to see that so many, of you, so many of you guys have been enjoying this uh this this channel and that's kind of like why i didn't start it earlier because i just kind of felt like who's gonna watch me anyway doing the little mundane things that i think i do because i think they're pretty mundane this is like typically you know and this is why i love this channel like it doesn't interfere 
with my life. It doesn't. Let me make this brow a little bit sharper. Sometimes this brow tends to be a little bit rounder than I want it to be. And guys, when I used to go to the salon, the the when I used to go to, to get my brows done, that's what I used to try to emphasize to the girls doing my brows. Like, can you make it sharp, not round? Then they'll give me a whole. Like, I don't want this. I want this, not this. <sighs> Why is that so hard? Like, I do not want McDonald's arches on my face like i just got real fed up and i just stopped going there because i'm like what's the point of me coming here and just letting you guys ruin my day like you know that's not fair for me that's just not fair so i just stopped going And then they kind of like always want to make it seem as though I'm being difficult because I'm asking for what it is that I want. And I never want to seem difficult, you know what I'm saying? But I'm just basically asking for what it is that I want. Excuse me. I should be able to do that. I'm not, I'm not going to lie, this concealer though. It makes things, it does so much. It makes things so sharp. It just brightens up the eyes. I freaking love it. Okay. But I think that's enough for me in these brows. Um, yeah. I think that's enough for me in these brows. I think they're good. Okay, so the next thing that I'm gonna do is, I always gotta go under my eyes and try to brighten it up. So I'm gonna basically mix my 440 foundation with my 420. And I'm just gonna mix that in with the bottom of my brush. Okay. Then I'm just gonna put a little there and just try to conceal those dark marks. I'm not planning to wear like a full face. I actually don't like to do that when I'm going out and about because that's just not my thing. If I'm going somewhere like a party or something, maybe I'll consider that. And even then, <laughs> I don't like to go out with like a full face. I just like to kind of hide the little imperfections that I see in my face. But this is as much as I like to do, to be honest. Like, I think that does a lot for me. Just blot that out. Last night I was like opening up to my husband about this new channel and just letting him know how much I've been loving this new channel and how it's so encouraging to see that you guys are enjoying the content, you know? Um, and sometimes I wonder about my the future that I have on my other channel. I'm just trying to be genuine with you guys there, you know? Um, if you guys have been following me for years, you already know that I've been on um, this platform for around four years and um, Sometimes I sometimes I wonder about the progress on that channel. I know I'm not as consistent as I can be. And that's a thing, like being consistent on a channel that only talks about one thing, um, it's kind of hard. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Imagine having to get up and talk about the same thing all the time. I know there are different fragrances and stuff like that, but it's not easy to maintain a channel that literally puts you in a box, you know, which is why I think a channel like this would be a little bit more fun and it would be just a little bit, uh, it would be more successful because it encourages me to be creative and be more consistent. 
I'm trying to be very delicate about this situation because I don't want y'all to think that I'm no longer going to upload on that channel. I will always upload on that channel, but I guess what I'm saying is um, it's hard to remain very, like, highly consistent on that other channel. I have my time when I'm like, I go win. You know what I'm saying? I really do. Okay, I think that's good enough for around the eyes. Okay, so I'm just going to put on a little bit of mascara. This is the L'Oreal Voluminous Original Mascara. I've been enjoying this mascara. I thought because I've been wearing like falsies, I thought my lashes were like dead and gone. No, I was just not using quality mascara. So now that I found this one, I have been noticing that my lashes are back they weren't gone they just needed a little bit of help so i say if you have short lashes try this one this l'oreal voluminous original mascara even though there's a bit of clumping but you could control that once you start to feel it get gooey and thick just take a step back and stop okay but yeah if you guys know about mascaras like what's the best mascara that you guys know that really works for you that gives you like um long lashes long full lashes but doesn't clump after like one or two applications because this one does clump i ain't gonna lie it does clump and it does get kind of messy like you have to be careful like if you're blinking too much it may mess up your lids so now that I think about it, I don't know if I would recommend it. I'm just happy that it's bringing out my lash, I ain't gonna lie. But you can't do a lot of quotes on this one. But it, it does pull them out, I ain't gonna lie. But already they are clumping, so I'ma just not do no more. But you could, I don't know if you guys could tell the difference. See that? Today is pretty cold, unfortunately. So I'm going to have to actually dress like a decent person and put on clothes. It's just cool. We're gonna be indoors anyway. Okay. Whatever is on this brush, I'm not even sure if there's anything on this brush. Kinda just wanna, I'll be wearing a mask, so I try not to do too much. Down here, okay. Put a little bit of color on my cheeks this is my nk poison apple palette and i think i'm just gonna go in with this color right here it's a little dark so i don't want anything too crazy it has a little shimmer to it which is kind of like what i want i don't want anything too bright anything too crazy today Okay, so I'm all dressed. So this is gonna be my scent of the day, which is my Lantini Eau de Toilette by Givenchy. This fragrance is beautiful. It's strong, so a little goes a long way. So I feel like that's all I need. So that's what I'll be wearing today. Okay, so this is my outfit of the day. I decided to just go with this purse 
because it's just simple it's small it fits my phone my keys my lippies I decided to just pack very lightly and I only brought these sandals so that's what I'm gonna be wearing today uh, some of you guys probably saw this outfit before because I did do a try on haul from rainbow so yeah this whole outfit is from rainbow okay every single thing okay from the purse to the sandals to the jeans to this little chocolate number this is what we got okay guys so i'm gonna end the vlog here if i do pick up anything at the mall i'll definitely let you guys know but i'm just gonna go out try to enjoy the rest of the day and i'll see y'all in the next upload